So my name is Lila McCoy, and during these unprecedented times, isolation and distancing has understandably caused many mental health challenges. I will be focusing on the mental health of athletes and team, individual and team athletes with the question, to what extent has the COVID-19 pandemic affected the mental health of athletes in the United States? For some context, here are the social distancing requirements. The CDC has required to be at least six feet apart and to spread to maintain the spread of COVID-19. Sports that have contact between players have been shown to have um, it make it much more difficult to maintain social distancing to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Activities that also have a higher level of exertion, such as exercise, present a higher level of risk of spreading COVID-19. These restrictions make it very difficult to continue playing sports as a whole, therefore leading to the cancellation of practices and events. So what is the urgency of this issue? Well, social distancing requirements have caused many athletic events to be canceled. As an effect of this, many athletes' mental health has decreased without opportunities to exercise. Yeah. OK, that's what I just said. Cool. OK. Um, so how does exercise even affect athletes? As listed by Garcias Falgueras in an article titled The Psychological Benefits of Exercise, the benefits include releasing stress, elevation of mood, and the release of chemicals that sustain depression and anxiety. Individual athletes are affected by, because as many competitions have been canceled, they have not been presented with the opportunities to exercise, therefore leading to the decline in mental health. You may think, well, just go to the gym. However, many athletic facilities have also been closed, leading, requiring athletes to spend more time at home without using coping mechanisms such as exercise. Athletes and teams are also greatly affected by this pandemic. Team athletes lose their sense of identity, as stated by Hull et al. For some, this opportunity will gone and never arise again. Thus, the sudden cancellation or postponement of these events and competitions will is likely to have immediate ramifications for some athletes' mental health. Team athletes also lose an important support system by losing contact with their team. As stated by Rubio et al., people accustomed to practicing outdoor sports with others presented higher levels of somatic symptoms at the beginning of confinement compared to those, compared to those used to practicing sports um, alone and indoors, though they also presented a sharper decrease in negative mental health outcomes. Maintaining consistency is an important part of maintaining mental health. As evidenced by Alicia Garcia Falgueras, exercise has to be of sufficient duration and intensity to produce any significant p positive psychological effects, being for that reason so important discipline and consistency and working out for good results. This is significant because without consistency that pairs with the practices and competitions, there will be a sharp decline in mental health in team and uh, individual athletes. Davis et al. also writes that disruptions to training and competition schedules can induce athletes' emotional distress. This further evidences how important maintaining consistency is. Finally, what is the solution to this? The proposed solutions I have are working out from home and participation in esports. Firstly, working out can be simply achieved by incorporating everyday objects such as using water bottles as weights, chairs as benches, and using stairs to your advantage. This would incorporate discipline and, and consistency into an athlete's everyday life. However, a limitation to this is maintain, maintaining the discipline to hold oneself accountable. However, this can be counter-argued with um, conducting research on one's own to uh, understand the important benefits of exercise. A second solution is the participation in esports. In an article titled Taking College Esports Seriously by Niall Skye and Jennifer Sunrise Winter, it is stated how esports players dedicated their time to their sports and team. This helps to maintain consistency with an activity and reconnects athletes to a support system. A limitation to this is internet access. However, in 2016, 82% of households had internet access as provided by the United States Census. Therefore, for many athletes, they can either train using household objects or participate in esports. This therefore concludes the question, to what extent has the COVID-19 pandemic affected the mental health of athletes in the United States? 
Athletes have been negatively impacted in the mental health aspect. However, with the solutions proposed and social distancing requirements slowly lifting, the mental health of athletes will eventually increase. Um, some information that I needed was um, how, uh, like, how discipline affects um, mental health, and I couldn't really, like, figure out how, like, to incorporate, um, like, everyday objects through research. I just had to, like, make a solution on my own. So, yeah. Okay. And then question number two. What might the real world implications or consequences be of your findings? And then what are the implications for this community? Um, I definitely think the real world implications is mental health. Obviously mental health leads to like a lot of things. Um, so I think increasing mental health is very, very important, especially like during these times. And so um, using these solutions like esports and working out from home, I think that can greatly increase mental health and like within the community. Okay. 